So, you guys said I missed a huge secret in my last video. Yeah, apparently when you head into the Despacito spider cave and say this magic phrase, Despacito, you will be rewarded with a badge. But, you guys are pranksters, and the last time I listened to you, something terrible happened. But anyway, I'm going to take your word for it and give it a go. So let's head to the cave. Also, I think whilst I'm heading to this cave, this gives me a quick chance to shout out my latest little music video that I made. If you want to go check that out here, it's pretty cool. But anyway, back to the video. Okay, so here we are. So I just go over to this spider right here, and I say, Despacito, just like that, and then, wait. He actually sent it back, and I also got the Robloxian high school badge. You mean it actually worked? I thought you guys were pulling a prank on me. Oh, well, I guess... Wait, what happened? What happened to my legs? Oh no, you guys didn't. You tricked me! Now I'm a Despacito spider forever! Oh jeez, what the heck am I gonna do? You know what? I know exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hide inside this treasure chest and wait for Chum Chum. This is gonna be such a good prank. <laughs> Here we go, any second now. Wait, what? Where did he go? But yes, guys, it is me, Callie, and welcome back to... Oh, jeez, the jetpack's malfunctioning again. Here we go! But yes, guys, today and finally, I'm going to get into the topic of exactly what we're going to be doing. And that is creating Dab Freddy Fazbear. Or Freddy Dab Bear, if you're, if you're cool enough. And guys, this is incredibly easy to make and looks super cool. Everyone's going to know who you are, especially if you hit them with the floss. Then they're going to be like, that's Freddy the Flossin Fazbear. Yeah, I just said that. And this flamingo is like dancing on my shoulder. That's so cool. But anyway, guys, enough of the talking. It is time to get into this tutorial. So let's do this. So guys, as always, we always begin with our normal self. As always, you know, we always begin. You know, how many times can I say always in one sentence? Like, really? I said it like a hundred times. But guys, we always begin as our incredibly handsome self. But we need to reset set our avatar as per usual and that is always step number one so to do that guys click the reset avatar button at the bottom of the screen and press where this will turn you back into your normal handsome self with my glitched cape but anyway dab on your mum. once you have adapted on your mum, guys you are ready to begin step number two which is to remove everything you are currently wearing now a lot of you guys seem to struggle with this step somebody actually commented a last video how do i remove everything i am wearing and i did show you but just in case you happen to miss it i'm going to show you one more time so i'm equipping a load of things because some of you guys go absolutely hard in the equip section like you just wear so much stuff and i'm like why do you want to be a crazy pineapple man but you know what is cool a crazy pineapple man so i kind of get it also there is a snake on my shoulder that's crazy but come to the tuning selection, guys, and simply click all of these boxes just like this. Click as fast as you can and remove everything that you are currently wearing. With step two out the way, you are ready for step number three, which is incredibly simple, guys, and that is to change our bodies. Now, in this case, guys, I am actually the correct body that I need to be, but if you are a woman or any other body shape, then you need to come to the body selection and simply just search man. Equip the man head, equip the uh, the man arm, this one right here. It looks like this. You can see up here the man right arm, and do that for all the body, or alternatively, simply come to bundles and equip this one right here, which is the man bundle. In fact, I'm going to do it for you guys that have to and then we can move forward from here so if you have done this guys come to the wearing selection and just remove your hair like that and you are ready now to start changing the way you look so unlike most of my other tutorials the first thing we're going to do now is change the clothes that we are wearing usually we leave that till the last thing but today we're going to start with it because we need to base our colors off of it so come to the pants selection first guys and click custom pants you'll see it at the top left here a box will magically fall down from the flamingo god in the sky input a following code guys and once you have done that simply press where just like this and it will give you the amazing freddy fazbear pants once you've done that guys come to the shirts because we need to do the exact same thing to match our gorgeously animated pants we need to come to the custom shirt box and again input a following custom code as long as you've copied the code right it should look just like this and guys if you look just like this you've done a freddy fazbear fantastic job 
Jeez, that was a tongue twister. Next, guys, come to the body selection and come to scaling. Click advanced and make your head scale almost full size and make your height slightly bigger and your width slightly bigger, just like that. Next, guys, you want to come over to the colors palette where you're going to want to select this brown. Come to the color palette and pretty much try and match it roughly to your body like that. Looks good to me. And uh, you may need to change this later, but it looks good for now. Now, guys, that we have our body looking like this, we need to come over to the faces selection and simply search panda, but instead of an A, you want to put a W just like that and equip the panda face. And as long as you've equipped the panda face, you should be looking pretty cool like me right now. But this is not a completed Freddy Fazbear. In fact, he doesn't even stand like this. So we're going to change the animation of him before we go any further. So to do that, guys, it's really simple. Simply come over to the animation selection and you equip the cartoony animation just like that. Now, as long as you've done that, guys, you've given him the animatronic animation. You need to now change his face to make him look more like a bear. So to do that, come to the wearing selection, come to hats and simply search bear and equip these ears right here, which are called the grizzly bear ears. Is. Simply make the tuning of them slightly smaller and they should sit on your head perfectly like that. In fact, somehow I managed to match the exact color of the bear ears to my head first try. Now, as long as you're looking like this, you can either make these bigger and bring them down a little bit if you want to, which I'm going to do just like that. And then I'm going to move on to the next step, which is to give myself the Freddy Fazbear top hat. So come to the hat selection and simply search top and you will find a hat, which I will find for you guys right now, which is called the Scrooge McDuck's top hat. Guys, equip that, come to tuning, make it as small as possible and bring the position of it down. You can alternatively make it taller if you want to, because this hat is actually quite tall, believe it or not just like that and it will give him that really cool look that he actually has now guys you can leave it here everybody's gonna know that you're freddy fazbear though if you really want to take it to the next step you can also add a bow tie by coming to the next selection and simply searching tie and equipping the one at the very bottom which is this one right here simply come to tuning make it bigger bring the position and rotation of it slightly up and to the front and down like that. Pretty cool, right? You can alternatively also come to the face selection and equip these crazy eyes right here, which, you know, they look a bit too crazy, I think. But if you guys like them, then equip them. They look just like that. They are very Freddy Fazbear styled. And a lot of you guys will probably use that. So I thought I would introduce that into the tutorial. But yeah. That is literally it. That is how you become Freddy Fazbear inside of Robloxian High School. And guys, don't even play around. If you saw this guy running through Robloxian High School, you would run. Unless you have a jetpack, then you would just, you know, jetpack away. Oh, I can see my house from here. If you guys did enjoy this video, then remember to hit the subscribe button. What are you waiting for? Alternatively, leave a comment or suggestion in the comment section down below letting me know what you want to see. Remember, guys, to like the video if you liked the video, and I will see you all in the next one. <gasps> Goodbye! I wonder if I should go and make Bonnie now. That would be such a good idea.